A truck bomb Saturday caused a fire and the collapse of a section of a bridge linking Russia annexed Crimea with Russia, Russian officials said, damaging a key supply artery for Moscow's faltering war effort in southern Ukraine. The Speaker of Crimea's Kremlin-backed regional parliament immediately accused Ukraine, though the Kremlin didn't apportion blame. Ukrainian officials have repeatedly threatened to strike the bridge and some lauded the attack, but Kiev stopped short of claiming responsibility. The bombing came a day after Russian President Vladimir Putin turned 70, dealing him a humiliating blow that could lead him to up the ante in his war on Ukraine. Russia's National Anti-Terrorism Committee said that the truck bomb caused seven railway cars carrying fuel to catch fire, resulting in a partial collapse of two sections of the bridge. The 19-kilometer, 12-mile, bridge across the Kerch Strait linking the Black Sea and the Sea of Azov opened in 2018 and is the longest in Europe. The $3.6 billion project is a tangible symbol of Moscow's claims on Crimea and has provided an essential link to the Crimean Peninsula, which Russia annexed from Ukraine in 2014. The peninsula holds symbolic value for Russia and is key to sustaining its military operations in the south of Ukraine. If the bridge were made inoperable, it would make it significantly more challenging to ferry supplies to the peninsula. While Russia seized the areas north of Crimea early during the invasion and built a land corridor to it along the Sea of Azov, Ukraine is pressing a counteroffensive to reclaim them. The bridge has train and automobile sections. Russia's National Anti-Terrorism Committee specified that the explosion and fire led to the collapse of the two sections of one of the two links of the automobile bridge, while another link was intact. Russia's energy ministry said Crimea has enough fuel for 15 days, adding that it was working on ways to replenish stock. Authorities suspended passenger train traffic across the bridge until further notice. Putin was informed about the explosion and he ordered the creation of a government panel to deal with the emergency. The Speaker of Crimea's Kremlin-backed regional parliament blamed Ukraine for the explosion, but downplayed the severity of the damage and said the bridge would be promptly repaired. Now they have something to be proud of, over 23 years of their management, they didn't manage to build anything worthy of attention in Crimea, but they've managed to damage the surface of the Russian bridge, Vladimir Konstantinov, chairman of the State Council of the Republic, wrote on Telegram. The parliamentary leader of President Volodymyr Zelensky's party on Saturday stopped short of claiming that Kiev was responsible but appeared to cast it as a consequence of Moscow's takeover of Crimea and attempts to integrate the peninsula with the Russian mainland.